microorganisms are tiny living beings which cannot be seen under the naked eye but they can be seen under a powerful microscope microorganisms also known as microbes and some are harmful and dangerous because they cause diseases microorganisms found in humans and animals that do not cause diseases or illnesses are known as normal flora normal flora is important because they can prevent the growth of pathogens by competing with other pathogens for nutrients they can stimulate the production of antibodies to fight pathogens they can stimulate the growth of body tissues in the colon and some can even synthesize vitamin b12 and k Microorganisms are classified into five main groups based on their shape, size, nutrition, method of reproduction, and habitat. For example, viruses, bacteria, algae, fungi, and protozoa. Viruses are not classified as plants or animals because they do not carry out the life processes of living organisms. For example, they do not respire, they do not excrete waste products, and they do not possess any nucleus, cell membrane, and cytoplasm. Viruses have various shapes. For example, spherical, rectangular, and broad shape. Viruses are the smallest microorganisms with the size of about 0.5 microns. And they can only be seen under an electron microscope. Viruses live as parasites in living cells and they'll move on to other living cells when the host cell dies. As a result, they cause damage and diseases to their hosts. Viruses can reproduce themselves in the host very quickly. For example, about two to three hundred new viruses are released from each bacterium. Viruses live in living cells and they'll form crystals when they are out of the living cells. Viruses in the form of crystals can survive for years until they get to live in new living cells. 